Gandhi, after such a good result on Boxing Day, that must be really frustrating today. Uh, I don't know if to mince my words or not. Um, I'm embarrassed with that performance today. Um, certainly the worst home performance since uh, we came to the football club. Um, and it's all down to, to attitude. Um, bottom of the table, going to be easy. We've just beat Lucaston away, and that just sums up the mentality of this side. You know, we're up there, we're down, we're up, we're down, and there's no consistency. You know, and, and to have you know every player today didn't turn up. You know, it's not not acceptable. Certainly at home, you know, at least show some fight, some desire, and it was just it was lacking. It was it, it was not there. We didn't get the ball and, and, and move it. We didn't play. We tried. We made subs at half time to try and rejuvenate us, but there was nothing at all there today, and it just boils down to attitude. And you know, unfortunately, Stafford wanted to win more than as they're fighting for their lives. They had more fight, more desire, more energy, and we just lacked in every department. Two goals in three minutes played such a big part in the first half, didn't it? I mean, it was, did the heads noticeably drop as far as you can send after that, or had they already started to? Because after a promising the first 10 15 minutes, just didn't, couldn't build on it. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, the first 10 minutes I thought Stafford started really well, then we came into the game a little bit. Um, and we had a bit of play and, and got a bit of joy with some, with some corners and some deliveries, but we switched off for the for the penalty. Uh, it's a cheap one, you know, and uh, another poor goal, second goal, and, and you know you can't give teams a, a, a lead, and, and we know with this team if, if 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 we don't score first, then then we're in trouble. You know, there's nobody to get around the lads and lifters and and, and drivers and. Uh, just so disappointing, and like I said, we you know we tried to shake it up at half time, and if if we'd have got one, we might have got, got back in the game and, and got on and won it. And then you know the ball goes forward, it doesn't doesn't stick, and then then you know we know about the lad Cook, he, he, you know he puts a worldie in the, <laughs> you know from thirty five yards. There's nothing we can do about that. And like I say, we we turned up just to shoot, um, you know crossing, delivery, passing, everything was just poor, so poor today, way below standard, but. You know, I, 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 one thing I can't accept is a lack of desire and a, and, a, and a poor attitude, and it was there, you know, in abundance today all over the pitch. And having not all that long ago seen us beat Radcliffe 4 0 here, top of the league, um, it, it must, whatever hair you've got left, you must, you must pull it out and not really, you know, when you can't follow it up against the side, then lower down the table and put in the same kind of displays. And I just said to the players in there after, I said, you know, as a manager, I have to. I have to deal with this because you know you can beat Radcliffe four 0 you know then you can go to Ashton and lose five 0 you know we, you can go to Wilkeston and win one 0 you know um, you can have some really good performances FC United and win Bradford Park Avenue and win and then perform so poorly like that at home you know a, a Christmas period when you know we've already dropped points at home to to Morpeth we put it right at Ilkeston you want to build on that and 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 you know. I said to him, I'm off the back performance today, you know, heavy pitch, just find a way to win and get three points. Uh, but, yeah, it's it's mentally draining, certainly managing managing players today, dealing with, uh, you know, lack of consistency. And some days, you know, we say we need, you know, at least nine players, you know, turning up, but we didn't have one single player turn up today. And that's, that, you know, that can't happen at any football club. And next week we go to another side who are struggling and fighting and the rest of it at St Colliery's won't be in this place to go anyway. Um, so how do you now, what do you change, how do you pick them up for that? Because again, on paper it's winnable, but display like that, a display like that I guess won't get us anything. Yeah, we've already spoke about that game already. You know, uh, it's not a nice ground. You know, uh, it would be a pitch like that. They're fighting for their lives. I said to them, some of you need to go away now and, you know, think about what you want moving forwards because, you know, um, our only objective was to get into the playoffs. You know, and we keep getting there and we call ourselves back in and we could have gone one point outside the playoffs today and, and you know, another bottle job. You know, I heard a couple of the fans say it, you know, at Bamber Bridge, you know, the big games and when you can really kick on and, and push on and, you know, we, we just haven't done that. And like I said, it's just so disappointing. As a manager, it's so frustrating because you know, my emotions go from, from high to low and I just can't, you know, put my finger on why we can't, you know, get that consistency and that desire and attitude, you know, 95% of the time. Okay, thanks, Gandhi.